walk you through baby's first year and the stages that I like to photograph. Now we do have a product line in our studio that photographs the baby every month of their first year. And we call that a year and 12 months. And during that uh, product line, mom can bring her baby every single month. And then we create uh, two products from that that are the main products. We create a large canvas piece that has the baby every single uh, month through the year in a finished piece. And then we, of course, do the album. For the client that doesn't choose the every month option, we offer stages and those stages are newborn, four months, eight months, and 12. And those are my favorite stages to photograph during the first year. For our newborn session, I like moms to get their babies into me in under 10 days. And that's something that's very important to me. After 10 days, it's a little bit harder to get them to stay sleepy and um, be able to just move them around how you want to move them. And so under 10 days, I have found is kind of your little window, your sweet spot um, of time, and to get that sleepy, sleepy newborn. And that's what newborns do, they sleep. And so I want them asleep during those sessions. So a lot of, of times I'm telling mom, you know, bring your baby right from the hospital. So when you get checked out of the hospital, I'm your next stop. And a lot of parents do that. In fact, a lot of parents come and they still have the armbands on from the hospital. And I love that. I love including those, um, the armbands and the images. At four months, all babies are holding their heads up really well and they are very expressive. In fact, they're changing their expressions at every single second. You know, they're just... Uh, making all kinds of new faces and they're smiling and, and really holding the, that head up really well. And uh, one of the products that I create from the four month session is called an expressions collection. And that's nine images of just baby faces. And I love that and it's a great seller at that stage because it's the first time that a parent has seen all those expressions together at one time. And I always wanna talk to my client about what is happening at that time in their baby's life. And so I, I will talk to them about those different expressions and the different faces that the baby's making because that makes the sale of the product that much more powerful. It's got a lot of meaning in it because we've discussed exactly what's going on at that time. At eight months, all babies are sitting up. And so that is the next stage that I like to photograph. I used to do the three, six, nine uh, stages but I found that at six months, a lot of babies aren't sitting up and it's, you know, it's hard to get a different image than you got at the three month session if they're not sitting up and doing something very different. And so I now like to go to that eight month uh, stage and they're all sitting up very well and holding themselves up well. And so I'm going to photograph them sitting and then on all fours, maybe crawling and you know, just again, whatever they're doing at that stage and I'm talking to mom about it. I'm talking to her about, you know, what, what's their, what's the favorite thing? Are, are they a, a baby that lays on their back to play with toys? Are they grabbing their feet? Um, you know, what's going on right now? And that's what I want to incorporate in the images. And the product that I sell at that stage is a storyboard and it's going to be three images and a storyboard. Um, a 10 by 30 is the typical size. And in that storyboard, it's going to be three things that they're doing now. Again, just really celebrating that age and stage that they're in. At 12 months, of course, it's birthday time. And so I will do a regular portrait of the child and then we do birthday cake. So we do the cake smash session with every single one-year-old. And it's also, it's a really great ending to their album uh, with that birthday cake and kind of that celebration um, in the last images. Through the entire first year, I'm usually suggesting products for the baby's nursery. And so I talk to mom about that starting when she's pregnant and we were talking about decorating the baby's nursery with their portraits. And there's a specific thing that I'm suggesting at each stage. They don't have to buy that, but most do because that's what I'm suggesting. And you know, so at that newborn stage, it's a full length baby sleeping and you know, usually just a large portrait that's gonna go above the crib or the changing table. And then we've got that expressions collection and then the storyboard. And then at the one year session, we do a baby cake designer collection is what we call it. It's a collage of birthday images, um, but that it makes a really nice uh, last portrait for the nursery. And then it's also the first time I'm suggesting that they, they take something into one of the living areas of the home. 
So I want them to, you know, have a traditional portrait, one-year portrait that they're taking out into a, a family room or a dining room or a playroom. So they're going to take it into another area of the home. I might also photograph the entire family at the one-year session. So again, they can take that family portrait into the living room. And then we do the birthday cake and, you know, then get excited about starting to create their album.